Uh, today we are making a video uh, how to assemble table and stand for heavy duty cylinder arm machine. Uh, the machines that we supply this type of uh, stand. Uh, people asking me for instructions and I thought the best way to do it, make a video and show you how this looks already put together and uh, give you uh, some uh, specifics uh, what parts and how they, we put this table together. So this already started putting together this, uh, this is what we call H style legs. They, there's a few of them coming. So there's a four 19 millimeter bolts. Uh, uh, they're largest bolts that come and that's where you put them. You put a bolt, flat washer, another flat washer from inside, lock washer and a nut on both sides. You adjust the heights, whichever desired heights you want. Um, and you will need some tools. You'll need metric, it takes metric uh, size tools, 19, 17, 14, 10 millimeter um, wrenches and then maybe sockets. And uh, after you put H sides together, the next step is take 17 millimeter, there's a four uh, bolts, uh, they are here. Same thing, you put flat washer on each side lock washer and, and the knot and you put them through there's two on each side two here and and two on, on the other side and after that you start putting uh, the, the bottom piece together the bottom foot bar there's a bolt with a rubber cushion you simply uh, screw it inside, there's a knot welded and it goes on the bottom here like that. Then you take foot pedals, they, they have springs on them. So the way they come, uh, you need to take this little bracket, take it off and flip it the other way. It works the best uh, for this setup. So you, you, you put your bottom foot pedals and they have uh, bolts there you basically put them through those slots and uh, bolt it down then there's two long bolts with flat washers on each side and a lock washer and they go through here and then you put them through the first slot and you slide them against the slot the next step would be putting round bar and those two brackets and those brackets, they take, you take them and put them in the slot. You put 14 millimeter bolt, there's another flat washer and a nut. You put them on each side, then you put, take a round bar and you take this brackets here. You put one here and you put one in the middle somewhere. And then you slide these collars here. You put this collar on this end and, and another collar on the other end. That, that'll keep bar from sliding around, you know, side to side. And uh, when you put this bracket here, you line it up with the motor control lever and you put connecting rod. It could be different motor, but it works for different motors the same. And you, you put this bracket, tighten it here. And then you go to the other side, put the second bracket here, and you put connecting rod. And you adjust it accordingly, uh, whatever heights you want. There's a bolt here uh, on the bottom, the bottom of this foot. You can, you can adjust the heights of the foot. And, you know, here you can loosen knot and adjust. That, that is big, you basically adjust accordingly. That's how you put it together. And that's how, how this stand looks like. But uh, once you see it, it's so much easier. And uh, when, once it's put together, I'll show you how, uh, then we'll also connect chain for the lift, for foot lift. 
through here, and, and that, that's what the second pedal for. This particular motor is nice, but I'm demonstrating basically the stand motor. You can put different motor, uh, any motor you, you desire, but this is how this, how to put this stand together.